Bible is making a claim to public truth. In other words, the claim is that these events happened in history. You can investigate the sources, you can look at material outside of the Bible as well to scrutinise whether the events recorded are true. But the claims being made are claims about truth that are either university re universally relevant or universally irrelevant. In other words, if it's true for me that there is a God who judges the world, that Jesus came in history and is able to deliver me from that judgment, then it's true for you as well. If it isn't true for you, then it isn't true for me either. This is a, a truth claim and it needs to stand or fall like any other public truth claim, be it gravity or global warming. So it's a truth claim which should be investigated historically, philosophically, morally. Does it stack up? But if it does stack up, then it's equally true for me as it is for you. I think that's looking at the question from an intellectual perspective. What is truth and is this true? We can also look at the question from a personal perspective. As I read the Bible, what does it mean for me? Is it going to actually change my life? And my answer to that question is yes. Because the claim of Jesus is that as you um, discover more about who he is, as you begin to follow his teaching and build a relationship with him, that that will be personally transformative. That will make a difference to you from the inside out. That's the radical claim of the Bible. It isn't just intellectual or historical or moral. It's also personal.